I grew up in a town called Kalgoorlie, which is in Western Australia. My mum's side is American. My dad's side of the family is Aboriginal, which is Native Australian. We used to travel in the desert, go around to indigenous communities, and I got to learn to live off the land and learn about the native people, how to do tribal dance. I had a lot of animals, had kangaroos, had dogs, had chickens, had doves. I think we had a possum at one stage. So <laughs> we're kind of like the family that had the zoo in Australia. I was actually quite shy when I was growing up. And it wasn't until I started actually being in the goalkeeper role that I had to force myself to be more extroverted and more assertive in how I held myself. It's made me become independent and adapt really quickly because I've had to, but also it's made me become strong-willed and mentally and emotionally strong. I got this tattoo and it says Yilkari. It's my Aboriginal middle name. It means heaven or sky and it was given to me by my tribal community back in Australia. I got it tattooed on me because I think it is something special. It reminds me of how I grew up, living out in the desert and my dad. My dad passed away when I was 15. It was three weeks when we found out he had cancer to when he actually passed away. And the last thing that he said to me was, he'll always be proud of me. He'll always be looking down and be there with me. I've never experienced emotion like that. I probably blocked out the first year after he passed away because I didn't want to deal with the pain. I think avoiding that only made it hurt more and then actually facing it full on, realizing that we missed him, definitely started the healing process. The way that I had to deal with that loss has helped me dealing with losses in football. And I think it's helped me calm things down a little bit and be able to relax in my own mind. One of the last things my dad said was, the most beautiful thing in someone's life is, is to love their friends and family. That legacy that he left is inspirational. The beauty of the little things in life has helped me where I am. I'm just happy to be here. I'm happy to play this game and I'm lucky to. That's been the major thing. I'm just happy. And I think everything that I've done, he'd just be over the moon about. It's time to kick. Kick that ball 130 miles per hour. Kick up a sprint every 90 seconds. Kick that heart rate up 167 beats per minute and go 45 minutes straight, no timeouts.